it's been a while since I did my last vlog and uh, I'm actually currently in Gothenburg in Sweden it's the 5th of uh, June at this moment and uh, I'm currently here because I felt like I just needed to take a small vacation uh, you know just go out eat go to cafes walk around the city I know this city by heart because I've lived here before but uh, I have actually been very tired the last couple of weeks and I have been working 80% and I have come home from work and I have felt this immense fatigue all the time and uh, I have been so so tired and um, that has been really really draining my energy for me so I want so that's the reason why I decided to just go and do something else for a while and um, I'm actually going home tomorrow, but uh, two and a half days here has been totally fine for me. You know, eating hotel breakfast and just treating myself. Uh, but I don't know what has caused this fatigue, but uh, you know, it comes and goes and goes in waves for me. And um, uh, I haven't felt that the situation at work has been tough or something like that. Uh, it hasn't been something in my personal life. Uh, so I just think it is the disease itself or the medication, but probably the, the, but probably the disease itself. Uh, However, something that is positive, it's my mental health. Uh, it's been really great the last couple of weeks. Um, I have felt so much hap I have felt so much happiness and joy, and that is something that I am continuing to feel because my mental health can also go up and down with my illness. Uh, and that can be a little bit tough, especially if you have a lot of fatigue. Uh, but it's it's something positive that, that I have had some really great mental health weeks. And I hope that that will continue. And that is probably linked to that I have continued to do my physical training i have been out running two or three times a week and then also i have been going to the gym and i felt that that is something that is really really great for me uh, it helps with my mental il illness in the long run or i should say that my mental illness is probably a symptom of my idiopathic intracranial hypertension but it has helped me to to control that but i haven't done a lot of physical working here in gothenburg except for the fact that i have been doing a lot of walks here in the city and actually just to to mention it i i didn't know when i arrived into the, the city that it was a major celebration going on, uh, and it was and it was actually two things that was, and I believe that it was two things that was celebrated. Um, first of all, Gothenburg was founded in sixteen twenty one, so they had their four hundred year celebration now two years late because of the pandemic. This is also the year that our king has been king for 50 years. He ascended to the throne at the 15th of September 1973. So the king has been here uh, doing some celebration. Uh, I think I might have seen him because of a car cortege. 
I don't know if they say car quotation in English, but anyway, a lot of cars passed by me and the streets was totally shut down by police officers. So I believe that was the king passing by. But I didn't see him. So, But anyway, I think it's time for me to go and eat some dinner right now. And uh, we'll see you in the next one.